Welcome back to Let's Play The Evil Within 2. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I've just discovered that if I reload this gun, I only have one left in uh, storage. Joy. This one, because it has more on it. Well, that's not a good sound. Well, I can't say I'm surprised to see that. I would have been surprised if, say, it had been... Oh, I don't know, if the noise had been made by a tap-dancing man dressed as a turkey? Oh, yes, this is bringing back bad memories. I should have used the silence pistol. That guy is dead. I'm not sorry. I've even stolen his juice. There's basically no way to say that and make it non-provocative. Hmm. Oh right, I can just do that. I was about to run. It was this way. Really? Yeah, I didn't think that was going to work. I just wanted to be over here. Or when the shit hits the fan. Oh. You didn't see that one coming, I'll tell you that. Huh, could have thrown he dropped something. Achievement unlocked, Smoke Assassin. Killed three enemies using upgraded smoke bolts. There is one more level of upgrade to the smoke bolts, which will make the smoke poisonous and do damage over time to anything caught in them except Sebastian. Behind me. Don't mind me. Handgun ammo pouch. Full size, 60 bullets. This nylon pouch is used to carry additional handgun bullets. Delicious. Imagine the heat that must be radiating off of that stuff. That bar must have been really hot. Ooh, lag. Yeah. He was on fire, get him! No! I forgot I had an axe, or I'd have just done that instead of using a freeze bolt. For the record. 
immediately after I got that axe, I got distracted by a big scary guy, so... Who should be just on the other side of this door, actually. Oh, Christ. the man go. Oh, right, he can just walk out, can't he? They're like fireproof or something. Calculator. I think he's in that room with all the blood. And he can stay there. And rot. <laughs> Can't crawl into that. Who the fuck hurt me? I mean, okay, kicking doors open isn't exactly subtle, but... Now you'll never be swole. It is nice to be at full health again. Cold burn hazard. Why is there liquid nitrogen in this church slash foundry anyway? Can I just do that? Okay. I wonder if that's meant to be a method of dealing with the guy. Can I open that or shit? Wait, can I just hit that? That's really low. Nope. It's empty. Fine. Oh, I can just do this. I had crouch about seven times before he actually did it, starting before I went down those little stairs. That's odd. Picking stuff up has always been a bit laggy in this game. Crouching is pretty immediate. Maybe you can't crouch when you're on the stairs. I don't remember if I ever tried. I mean, I don't see any uh, nozzle to shoot. Maybe I'll get lucky and it will also disable this one. Or this wheel will also disable that one, rather. Rather than just these, which the camera is suddenly pointing at. Fuck. Wait a minute. I can just... Really necessary, but I'm checking the number.
Okay, what's the point of any of this? Well, I can close this gate, but why? I don't want to accomplish anything. I think the idea... I think the idea is that I lead the Harbinger in here and then close the door behind him. I mean, now that I have the power of stabbing and freezing, I feel pretty good about it. I'm just saying. Fuck am I? Right. I don't know why I thought that would work. Oh, I missed that detail. So you can stow just that one weapon. Okay. I don't know where the fuck I'm meant to be going here. You might have noticed that I didn't pull the lever on the cage room. That's not a coincidence. Because as far as I can tell, that room is a trap, and I don't want to spring it before something terrible is in there. Is any of this new? No. Okay, where the fuck am I meant to be going? Alright. Wall time. I'm gonna hug this left wall. And it should, in the fullness of time, lead me where I'm going. Hope it wasn't in there. Honestly, when I pulled that one, I just thought it was going to turn off more fire. All right. It's literally the only thing left. Alright, just checking. Okay, here we go. Uh, hi there. Where the fuck... You don't. Ah, oh, God damn it. Clever girl. Nope. Kill it with fire. Kill both of you with fire! Almost, the, the sound effect is almost like he's just slurping it up through a fucking straw. Yoink. 
I did see the big puddle, but you know. Oh, you're not an elevator at all. Okay. I offer you one more chance to join with the right side of history. Otherwise, you'll be stuck in your own tortured mind. I'm not making any deals with you, friend. Up. Oh, I can't lock on when I'm directly underneath it. Okay. You found her. Excellent. I don't think I really need to, but I'll do it anyway because I can. Is ammo looking? Uh, save point over here. I don't know what that was about. Fine. Seven thousand. There was something here for seven thousand. Detective Castellanos. You'd think he would get tired of having needles stabbed in his brain over and over and over again. That's a few hundred flamethrower fuel right there. Uh, Six thousand twelve hundred. Eight thousand. I'm not worried about the kickback. I think I will just save up for uh, the other things. You're emanating power and confidence. I'm close to the end. And I've learned a few things. I just want to take care of this once and for all. I can provide you with some help. But... But what? You must be cautious. You have overcome challenges. But too much certainty can be dangerous. Clearly. He will prey on you, using the darkest corners of your mind. Then I'd better get ready. <sighs> oh, 200 weapon parts. Damn! Thought there was something over there. Actually, yeah, fuck it. Oh, right. Expensive! That's why I didn't do that. Ha 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 ha. Dumbass. Sure. As you do. Sorry about that. Although I do see on my timer that the session is about to end. So, uh, I guess I'll call it here. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you 
on the next episode of Let's Play the Evil Within 2. Sounds like we're getting closer than ever to confronting Theodore and putting an end to this nightmare permanently. Later. <laughs>